So it's come to this. Walmart, America's biggest bricks and mortar retailer, has issued a warning about shoplifting. It's so bad that they may have to close stores, Walmart closing stores and raising prices. We're all going to pay for this. In the real estate, I'm sorry, in the retail business, it's called shrinkage. How much of the stuff on the shelves is stolen? It runs to billions a year at Walmart, and the CEO says it's getting worse. This should not come as a surprise. How many times have we shown you people walking into a store, loading up and walking out without paying, and without a peep from security guards? It's okay to take up to 950 bucks worth of necessities in California. That's just an invitation to steal. Many retailers are responding by locking stuff up. Razor blades, cosmetics, batteries, just about anything that you can walk out with. So you have to spend time waiting for someone to unlock what you want. The stores are getting killed. You just go to Amazon, don't you? It's easy to blame liberal district attorneys who take no action to stop this surge. And they do deserve some blame. But I think there's something else going on here. I think there's a change in attitude towards theft. It's now justified as taking what you are entitled to. And it's encouraged by laws which suggest that if you need it, you should have it. If this is the new morality, you can count me out.